problem. Uh, and then, uh, then I heard you show that he's going to be out for. It'll, it'll also be in contention to potentially go into it. And uh, the last one was Louis. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Louis uh, uh, has made, made really good progress, and we're happy to start with Louis. Um, having said that, Cameron has really done well for us. Uh, he's, he's improved in every game. Uh, and it's great to have two top scrum of uh, in the squad. Coach, just looking at your preseason, you had two quite <coughs> official games for your friendies, yeah. and then the Lions and then the break. Do you think that's helped you um, ease into the season, making it a bit more like a bit, a bit better than having one break and then back onto it again? I'm not too sure, actually, Darren. I'm not too sure if it's a good thing, you know. Uh, but, um, yeah, I, I mean, we had in, in, in the off week, uh, uh, we used the time well. Um, but it was also time for, for a couple of guys that had some. Uh, you know, they had flu or had a couple of niggles to recover properly. So, uh, we had a great week of training, and the boys are are really looking forward to the challenge. Well, what do you, what do you think of, of getting a bye so early in the competition? Does it help you? I thought I answered that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, 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 as I said, I, it does help if you have a couple of niggles and you, you know, there's guys that that have got flu and stuff like that. So that. And then it then it's a good thing. Um, we don't mind we don't mind the buy. Uh, you know, obviously uh, Saturday is a massive one for us. Our first home game, all, all our home games are really going to be important. And you also you mentioned about players um, getting ready for the tour. Mm. Obviously, it's still a while away, but this this game and the next one quite important at home to kind of get the season going. Yeah, I, 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 it's, it's it's huge. Saturday is. Going to be huge for us uh, to have a great performance. Um, having said that, you know we we um, we can take twenty seven guys on tour, um, and there'll be a game tomorrow night for the guys that are not involved with the, the match twenty three on Saturday. So uh, that's an opportunity for those guys to, to to play them into into the squad to go to Australia, and New Zealand. So at this stage, we, you know we're looking at. Uh, we, um, you know, because there's been such good competition in the squad, um, uh, and, and hopefully the guys that, that do get the opportunity this weekend uh, uh, will, will, you know, will cement their place in the, in the squad. And then um, I'm sure you had a, w a look at the Stormers Waratahs game. What did you make of their strengths, their weaknesses? Yeah, I, I, I haven't, I haven't seen too many weaknesses at this stage. I think they. Um, they a team um, that has improved uh, a lot from from last year. Uh, um, they have they have uh, guys that uh, that that's players with X factor. So um, yeah, I think it's going to be a it's going to be a very tough encounter uh, against them. Um, it's, uh, you know, it's always tough playing against the Waratahs, and so will be no different. You've also got a few um, youngsters who wouldn't have come up against the likes of these world class, yeah. Gerald Bilal, Kirky Beal. Um, could be quite a big learning curve for them. Yeah, but that's that's what this competition is all about: is to test you against the best players in the world, and, and they certainly have a few of those in their team. Um, he's just looking at the forwards. Um, we spoke to the guys during uh, during the week, and they said a lot of effort had been put into the scrums in the bar week. Um, how's how's scrumming been going in training? Well, obviously, uh, we were not happy with our performance against the Lions. Uh, it was substandard, but I think uh, you know we've been. Uh, I think the guys have been working hard at it during the preseason, and we just went back, you know, to the basics and making sure that uh, you know we've got uh, cohesion in the pack. So it's something that we want to rectify. Saturday and uh, yeah, something we're taking very personal. And also um, watching the Waratahs game, they seem to struggle a bit against um, the Stormers pack. Is there anything you can identify in their pack that maybe you can take advantage of? No, I think obviously they, they've got a, an experienced pack, so uh, we obviously are not looking too much at the Stormers game. We think we're looking at, at it as a, you know, a new challenge for us and you know, an opportunity as well for us to really make a step up and you know and tick a box that uh, we didn't tick in the, in the, in the first game
Any further and questions? And with Mark on the head side, there's been a new te technical team that has been announced what is being built. What are your thoughts on that? I haven't even seen it, sorry. And this is shark specific, guys. I haven't seen it. Okay, any further questions? There's two one-on-one -on -one requests for beast